हेलो फ्रेंड्स माई सेल्फ राजेंद्र महाजन प्रेजेंटिंग माई वीडियो ऑन पार्सल्स आइडेंटिटी फॉर द फोर इयर ट्रांसफॉर्म इफ एफ ऑफ लैमडा एंड जी ऑफ लैमडा आर द फोर इयर ट्रांसफॉर्म ऑफ द फंक्शन एफ ऑफ एक्स स्मॉल एफ ऑफ एक्स एंड जी ऑफ एक्स respectively then number 1 1 by 2 pi integral from minus infinity to infinity f of lambda into g bar of lambda d lambda is equals to integration from minus infinity to infinity f of x into g bar of x dx first result second result 1 by 2 pi integration from minus infinity to plus infinity f of lambda bracket square d lambda as integration from minus infinity to plus infinity absolute value of f of x and its square with respect to x where bar denotes the complex conjugate bar denotes the complex conjugate watch the video up to the end for better understanding clear understanding parcels identity for fourier sine and fourier cosine transform for fourier cosine and fourier sin transform number 1 two by pi integration from 0 to infinity f of fc lambda fourier cosine transform into gc lambda d lambda is equals to integration from 0 to infinity f of x into g of x dx this is the first result and second result 2 by pi integration from 0 to infinity f of fc lambda bracket square with respect to lambda is equals to integration from 0 to infinity absolute value of f of x its square and dx uh, second for sine transform 2 by pi integral from 0 to infinity fs lambda into gs lambda d lambda is equals to integral from 0 to infinity f of x into g of x dx and second result 2 by pi integral from 0 to infinity of fs lambda bracket square with respect to lambda integral from 0 to infinity absolute value of f of x and its square and its integration with respect to x then evaluate integration from 0 to infinity of x square divided by first term x square plus 4 into second term x square plus 9 with respect to x by that parcels identity a uh, given integration from 0 to infinity x square divided by x square plus 4 into x square plus 9 we can rewrite as integration from 0 to infinity x square we can split as x upon that x square plus 4 into x upon x square plus 9 and its integration with respect to x we know that in if f of x is equals to e raised to minus 2x then its fourier sine transform is lambda upon lambda square plus 4 or 4 plus lambda square and 
if g of x is equals to lambda uh, e raised to minus 3x then its sign transform is lambda upon 9 plus lambda square a standard results then by Parswell's identity we have the result 2 by pi integration from 0 to infinity fs lambda into gs lambda d lambda as integration from 0 to infinity fx into g of x dx and therefore 2 by pi integration from 0 to infinity lambda upon 4 plus lambda square multiplied by another term lambda upon 9 plus lambda square d lambda as per this result it is integration from 0 to infinity fx means e raised to minus 2x g of x means e raised to minus 3x and its integration with respect to x it is nothing but e raised to minus 5x its integration as e raised to minus 5x upon minus 5 limit from 0 to infinity 1 by 5 changing the limit e raised to 0 we get 1 and minus e raised to minus infinity e raised to 0 is 1 e raised to minus infinity is 0 and therefore we get 1 by 5 as the value and therefore integral from 0 to infinity of lambda square upon 4 plus lambda square multiplied by 9 plus lambda square and its integration with respect to lambda is that 2 by pi we transfer to right hand side it become pi by 2 into that value 1 by 5 it become pi by 10 and as it is definite integral replacing lambda by x we get integration from 0 to infinity of x square upon 4 plus x square into 9 plus x square its integration with respect to x as pi by 10 answer please like my video share it as well as subscribe to my channel and to receive the notification please press the bell icon thank you thanks for watching